Hey everyone, Steve here, and welcome to my MailZap review. MailZap is a first-to-market email autoresponder with two unique features. Firstly, it uses AI to help you increase your open and click rates, and it also has no monthly fees. So you pay one time and you have the plan forever. It also comes with a built-in SMTP, so you can simply log into the app and start sending emails, okay? This is a really, really great solution for people who want to start emailing email marketing or for more advanced email marketers who want to utilize the benefits of artificial intelligence to get better inboxing and more sales. Let's take a look. Okay guys, so I'm on the Mails App bonus page now and you really do want to watch all this video because I've put together probably the best bonus package I've ever secured for you, including a collection of software apps that which to collectively are even worth more than Mails app on its own, okay? So you wanna to stay till the end to find out what those are. And as always, if you like the review, please hit the like and subscribe buttons or any questions, comment below and I'll get back to you. Okay, so this is the bonus page. I'll talk about this later on and the funnel and the OTOs, but let's get right into Mails app right now to take a look. And as you can see, one of the key selling points for Mails app and really kind of what makes it is the fact that it has this little box here. Mails app's AI learning mode is on, machine learning is on, and will continue to learn from various metrics on your account. So as you send more emails, as Mails app collects more data, and this is specific to you, you, your account, your behaviors, your subscribers, your emails, it learns more and it will improve your open and click through rates with various different methods, okay? So the, the learning mode is on um, because this is a new account. And yeah, we'll just kind of go through it step by step. So again, no need to plug in an SMTP to this. You can simply go ahead and send emails straight away. And also no monthly fees, okay? Now Mails app does come with a number of integrations, but I think they increase as you increase in plans. So I've I've only got the front end, the silver license here. But I think if you want the Zapier integration, you need to be the, the planner, but we'll talk about that later on. So here's my account here. Um, you've got all the various different um, metrics you would expect an email autoresponder to have, and actually a lot more. We can see we've got reputation health here. So this keeps your email IP nice and healthy. Um, the amount of emails you can send, the storage you've got, etc. You can add your contacts manually. You can import them. You can with a CSV, etc. If you want Zapier, you can also uh, use that too to um, import your list over via API. So we'll click on my account here, We've got different settings, your profile, um, the information on your plan, um, agency management, reseller management, if you need that. Um, you, we've got the SMTP here, but I wouldn't um, fiddle with that unless you're, you know what you're doing. And you've got integrations, of which there are plenty. So on the left-hand side, we've got broadcasts, which is simply, if you want to send out an email to your list, you go with broadcast. Your list are under contacts and you can create multiple different lists in here. You've got workflows, which is automation. So it's great to see that a autoresponder without monthly fees actually has automation. So you can go ahead and set up sequences for new subscribers, people who join your list, abandoned card emails, that type of thing. You've got reports, so full analytics suite. Sign up forms to get people to join your list, um, you know, landing pages, put forms on your website and things like that. Um, and different e-commerce functionality here if you've got an online store. So let's click on broadcasts and take a look. And you know, right now this is a fresh account, so I've got no emails or anything like that, but let's click on create a new broadcast. And you've got three different options here. You've got the HTML editor, the plain text editor, and the drag and drop. So let's go with drag and drop. Um, and I'm gonna call this broadcast name, uh, let's just say, um, I don't know, Friday feature. I don't know why I called it that, but there we go, Friday feature. Now the broadcast name is simply a label for yourself. Your subscribers don't see that. It's not the subject line. Okay, so first really, really cool feature here. So in broadcast details, um, we want to be giving it um, send to. So this is where you select the lists or lists that you want to send it to. I don't have any lists here right now, but what I'll do, I'll create one. Um, there are no contacts currently. So we'll click create new list. Uh, we'll just say manually one by one. List name, uh, we'll just say um, new subs list description, uh, new subs from landing page. And we'll create this list. So you want to be doing everything properly. 
Okay, so let's, we can send to this new list now. And you can also do an exclude here. So this is if you want to um, prevent certain contacts from receiving broadcasts. If you want to segment your list, if you only want to send it to people with a certain behavior, etc., you can do that. That's really, really powerful. Um, and you, know, you really want to be segmenting your list and only sending relevant emails to relevant people, okay? So we'll just click Save here. Um, and then from, so this is basically, you know, put Steve or Steve Harvey from email address. We can set that up there and reply to email address. You want to set that up there also at the start. It's important to have your send from and reply to emails the same. This will get you better delivery rate and better inboxing, okay? Okay, so here's the first cool feature. I thought it was on the panel before. This is the first cool feature, okay? This is the subject line, and this is where the AI engine learns from um, at the start. So right now, I'm just going to enter in, you know, um, hey guys, what's going on? Okay, don't use that terrible subject line. But right now, you, you can see I've just entered that in there and nothing's happened, right? And this is because the AI, this is a fresh account, has only just started learning. So I've got, I've not sent any emails, I've got no data to give it. So it can't give me any suggestions because it's got nothing to go off, right? As you continue to use your account, as you send more emails, get more data, um, it will start to give you suggestions based on behavior, okay? And this is the AI engine kicking in. And I've not seen another autoresponder that has that, especially one without any monthly fees, okay? Really, really good. Preview text. Um, this is basically, you know, what people kind of see in the first line on mobile or what have you. Some people use it, some people don't. Um, and you, you know your physical address, you want to be keeping this, you know, all legal and everything. So you put your physical address there um, and show up at the bottom of the email. Um, and right now we can click on edit email. Um, we can use one of these blank layouts or you can use one of the pre-designed templates. Okay, so let's just go with a blank layout for now and just see what we can do. And you can see, you know, we've got the title um, here. Okay, what's going on, guys? And there's a drag and drop editor, right? So there's no content here right now. So we maybe want to put an image at the top. And we want to put our text below the image. And you can see how easy this is to do. Okay. And we've got different content here. And then we've got what's called blocks. And you've also got um, body settings here. So you can change you know, the color of the links, content alignment, how wide you want it to be, how you want it to show up on mobile, etc. Um, you've got lots of different options there. Um, and you've got different actions here. So this is really, really cool. Um, these type of things here. So you've got different greetings. Um, and again, these can be saved ahead of time. And if you want to connect your products up, so this is um, really powerful. If you've got an e-commerce store and you want to connect different products to Mails app, you can go ahead and do that. Um, obviously, I have, I have not got anything at the moment. Um, and you can save different layouts and send a test email. So let's click Save and Next. Um, and yeah, we can then go ahead and save. Right, so it's not let me doing it because I've not put a physical address in, but if we were gonna do it, we can either send now or we can schedule it ahead of time. And you're probably gonna wanna be scheduling it ahead of time um, and then away you go. So you can see how easy it is to get all that set up. The drag and drop editor is very responsive and you've got the AI engine turned on and working. So when you've got enough data, you can s tailor your subject lines and your content based on Mails app suggestions, okay? So let's go back. Um, contacts, you know, you've got contact lists and segments. You can segment your, your contacts here really, really nicely. Um, and, you know, give it various different rules, which is really nice. And, you know, I was quite surprised about this, um, the automation functionality within Mails app because typically autoresponders that have no monthly fees um, or one-time fees only, um, they will either need an SMTP connected to it, or they just won't have any kind of, you know, this powerful automation. But this has a fully functional um, automation sequence. So we'll just click here, welcome sequence. Um, and then you've got e-commerce if you wanna go ahead and um, put your e-commerce store connected with products and things like that. So people will get, you know, um, emails based on, you know, their transactions and their behavior, etc. So that's, you know, a quick run through of what Mails app can do. And, you know, I've been, um, you know, I haven't been using it that long, but I've been quite impressed with what I've seen so far. And it would be nice to use the automation feature to, uh, to show you, but it was very easy, just as easy to do a broadcast to connect those sequences up. So, um, yeah. Um,
you know, I, I should go through all of these as well when I start using it seriously. So that's Mail's app. So again, you know, if you were looking for an autoresponder that has a few unique things like AI and you don't want to pay any monthly fees and you don't want to connect it to an SMTP, then Mail's app is a really good option for you. It's an even better option because not only because of the pricing, but also because of the bonuses available if you decide buy through my link below. Okay, so introducing the first ever email marketing tool that uses AI to get more of your emails open and clicked with zero monthly fees. All right, Mails app works really, really hard for you. Take a look at this bonus page, link below guys, and read all the different things it's got for you. Um, you know, like I say, read all these because it's very, very impressive. So there's two options for the front end, one-time fees for Mails app. You've either got the silver version, which is $47, which is what I've got, or you've got the gold version, which is $97. Now there is some significant benefits um, to the, from the gold version to the silver version. For example, um, you get in gold everything in silver and a lot more unlimited emails with gold. You only get 5,000 cents with silver. So if you're a real beginner, silver is going to do fine. But gold, I think, is you know, you know, you, you get everything. I just showed you the drag and drop editor, split testing, all that kind of stuff. Okay. So for $97, unlimited emails is amazing right there's no other price out there like that okay and if there's something that's cheaper um there's been a few order responders released lately that just haven't been worth the time guys stay away from them okay oto one mails up platinum 97 dollars one time okay this is where it comes into its own you get um agency rights five more users zapier integration really important okay guys use zapier for everything advanced ai management reporting web push notifications unlimited sign up forms landing pages um, unlimited contacts. So again, um, you've got unlimited emails and then you've got unlimited contacts also just with the, the platinum plan. Okay. Definitely, you know, the platinum one I say is the way to go. OTO2, which is Mails App Commerce. And um, this is if you want to connect it to an e commerce store and, um, you know, have full product functionality. Okay. Um, you know, unique product pages, that sort of thing. Um, I'm not into e commerce a lot right now. Um, but if you have an online store, then definitely. Okay. OTO3 is Mails App Reseller. If you think you can resell this, then this is the way to go. And OTO4, Mails App Done for Your Email Pack, $97. Um, if you're not comfortable or experienced with creating high converting emails or copy or don't have the luxury of time to do so, you can use this. All right. So there's an absolute ton of bonuses if you decide to get Mails app through my link below. Okay, guys, um, I'm going to reset this timer for about 48 hours. So for the next couple of days, you'll be able to get them. If the timer is still there, guys, it means I reset it again. So you're lucky. You can still get the bonuses. If the timer has gone, it's gone. Okay. Or pop me an email and ask me if they are still available. So if you decide to get Mails app one time free through my link below, you're also going to get full feature access to a standalone brilliant app guys called convert me to app. Okay. And what convert me to app does it allows you to turn any website or web app into a desktop app. So we mean like a windows web uh, app or a Mac app. It's basically a Chrome extension and it does it in three easy steps. Okay. So you, you can create unlimited white label apps with this amazing bonus. So you plug it into Chrome, install it into Chrome, and you can find any website or web app and turn it into a desktop offline app. Okay. Super awesome um, bonus there. Again, worth a ton of money. You're also going to get full feature access to proxy my mail. So basically this allows you to use an email address in secret via proxy. So you don't have to use your personal email address anymore ever again and that way people can't spam you can't annoy you etc um so you don't have to give out your email address if you don't want to that's really cool you're also going to get full feature access to coach zippy live so this is a great software i actually promoted last year and um, it's the world's only online education system that allows you to conduct both live and pre-recorded sessions that follow a curriculum okay this is something that no other platform does so basically you know it's a live, it's a flagship online education system that allows you to do live and pre-recorded sessions okay so if you've got any sort of online course or you want to create one this is super awesome to do it with okay coach to be live you're also going to get my mails app challenge where i'm going to take you through on a webinar um, how to build a really, really great money making automation sequence that's my mails app challenge you're also going to get my five figure campaign frameworks this is an email framework that i created that i use in my own promotions which you're then going to get simply fill in the gaps guys and you're going to make money from promos you're also going to get and then there's, there's so many bonuses right full feature access to smart newsletter builder Full features access to Zapdesk. That's crazy. Zapdesk is basically um, it's a online support um, online system. So you know, think of like Freshworks or Zendesk. Okay, Zapdesk is basically a competitor to those. So if you want to set up your own support desk, you can. Full feature access to NoteZap. Full feature access to personal finance management tool. Twenty plus WordPress themes for all types of online businesses. Superforms. 
and that's it okay i need to run out of breath then but huge huge bonus pack okay to go with mail zap which is already a one-time fee so you know if you're looking for something with no smtp want to be able to send emails straight away want unlimited contacts unlimited emails and no monthly fees mail zap is really cool and check out the ai all right because it's unique and i've not seen it before and it works really well all right so i hope you enjoyed that that was my mail zap review Check out the bonus page, read through it, get impressed. And if you have any questions, comment below. Once again, my name is Steve. This is my Mails app review, and I'll see you on the next one. Thank you.